Dear Sheila, I want to start my own business, but I can't financially afford it. I'm scared to get a big loan because if this business doesn't become a success, then I'll be screwed. I can't risk becoming homeless. I have a wife and two kids, but I don't like my job anymore. It has long hours, no respect, and we're barely scraping by. I want to be the boss. I want to be able to bet on myself. I want to make enough to be able to afford to put my two teenage boys into a good colleges one day. What can I do to guarantee that my business will be a success? How do I find the courage to bet on myself? What do I do if I screw up and we lose everything? Signed, Wanting to be a Boss. Dear Wanting to be a Boss, well, there's a lot to do regarding being your own boss and starting your own business. The first thing is now it's easier than ever before. You don't have to have a lot of other people's money or invest a lot of money to start your own business. And I wouldn't suggest quitting a job to go into business for yourself either. For me, I started my first job when I was 23 years old. My, my first business that is and I left a job but I did it slowly over time and when I did that I opened a gift store and that first store took a lot of savings yes and time to figure out but when I did take that move and invested in myself it was the best decision I ever made now it, that takes a long time and a lot of courage nowadays you can start off a lot slower and easier. So I would suggest a part-time situation where what field do you want to go into? Do you want to even go into the field that you're already in? Are you helping your employer make lots of money? So I would sit down first of all and see what your talents are. How are you contributing to the con to the company that you already work for? How much are you getting paid per hour and can you charge more as a freelancer or start a small company doing what you do now for um, the fee that your company is charging? And that difference would be a great way to earn extra money. You're going to have to work two jobs. And then at some point, whether it's part-time on the weekend or in the evenings, once you can prove to yourself that that job is earning money, as soon as that job starts to earn enough money to pay your basic needs and, and you start saving up, that extra money is going to go into your savings fund. That's enough. You need to have six months saved up. And once you can prove that you're making enough money to do it part-time and it's, it covers your living expenses, then you can start actually leaving your company or working part-time and go into your own business full-time. Especially when you have children, it sounds like you're married with children, so it may be something definitely to discuss with your spouse and just have fun with it. And that's the best way to go into business for yourself without debt, without borrowing money from other people and having fun sharing your talents with the world. I hope this helps. As always, I wish you life, love, laughter, and light. Thank you for listening to Dear Sheila, answering real questions with real solutions to reboot your life. If you have a burning question, submit your question now to www.dearsheila.com. www.dearsheila.com.